One of the Metro's most popular shopping malls is now the center of a police investigation after a woman attacked a man with a gun. It happened at 11.30 this morning at Oak Park Mall in Overland Park. Sayed Shabir is live there now with what happened. Chris, the Oak Park Mall gets thousands of customers every day, and this morning, one of those customers found himself in a fight for his life. It happened right here inside this parking garage to the east of Nordstrom. Police say the attack is proof that crime can occur any place, any time, and to anyone. No matter where you're at, whether it's at Oak Park Mall or whatever mall, you just have to be on your guard. Teresa Lover is a frequent shopper at Oak Park Mall and doesn't take any chances when she's with her daughters. You don't know if you're going to be attacked. You don't know if somebody's going to steal your purse. You don't know anything. Monday morning, the popular Overland Park Shopping Center turned into a crime scene when a woman attacked a man in the parking garage. Today, you just don't think about a female going up to an adult male, regardless of size, and asking for your wallet. That's a concern for us, but also a wake-up call to anybody who thinks they may be invincible. Police say the shopper refused to give up his wallet, so the woman hit him in the head with her gun. A short fight broke out before a second man grabbed the gun from the woman and aimed it at the victim while both suspects escaped. The shopper was able to keep his wallet and suffered minor injuries. Still, police say fighting back is not recommended. When it, uh, weapons involved, then all bets are off, and it's just easier to go ahead and give them what they want and not fight them. Your life is worth more than uh, credit cards or any cash you had in your wallet. Those can be replaced. Just another reason for Lover and her little girls to be extra careful. Now, we reached out to Oak Park Mall to see if any changes will be made as a result of this attack, but they declined to comment on their security measures. Meanwhile, the suspects, both male and female, were last seen in a gray Chevy Equinox. Anyone with information is asked to call the TIPS hotline, 816-474-TIPS. Reporting live tonight in Overland Park, Sayed Shabir, 41 Action News.